Hey everyone, happy Friday. It's Haley here filling in for Maddie today. I'm going to talk about the topic that um, Holly briefly touched on and it's to do with having kids in the LGBT community or I guess specifically um, having kids as a lesbian couple. Um, I It's actually interesting. Last year in university in my um, topics in childhood development, one of my fourth year psych courses, I actually wrote a paper on um, all the it's like a whole like a whole summary of the literature on um, adopting children as a lesbian couple so I actually went back and I read it and it was pretty darn good <laughs> but I read the paper um, and so it got me thinking about this topic and something that I came across that I thought was interesting um, to share some little facts with you guys was I, I wrote them down right here was that in um I feel like I'm like teaching you guys now that I'm giving you like some silly facts you guys probably don't care about but it was only in May 1995 that um, Ontario was the first province that actually legalized gay couples to adopt that, that in 1995 they were finally through legal means to adopt a child that, that sounds silly when I say through legal means like before 1995 they were adopting children illegally so 1995 that is not too long ago I think it's crazy that at one point in time it was illegal for gay parents to adopt a kid that's silly. Um, not that that's the only one. Of, that's the only way that a, a lesbian couple can have a child. They can. Um, there's so many different uh, options. You can use a surrogate. You can go through artificial insemination. You can adopt. Um, uh, some some one of the partners could have children from a previous relationship. Um, I'm missing something. There's there's all these different options. Um, for me personally, I um, I want to adopt. I don't want to have my own biological children. I, I don't want to do that. I want to adopt a child. And I've said that even before I um, knew I was gay. So even when, as a young kid, I always said to myself, I wanted to adopt children. So yeah, um, adopting children to me, that's something that I'm very adamant about and that I strongly believe in. I really want to give a child a chance to have the life that they never, that they maybe wouldn't have been able to. So, yeah, I'm going to be, maybe me and my partner will be the new Brad and Angelina. Why not? Um, mm -hmm. So having children for me is really important. I wouldn't se consider seriously dating a girl that didn't want children at all or um, wasn't open to the idea because that's something that I've always dreamed about. Unfortunately, all of the options that are available out there are extremely expensive. Adopting a child? It, it doesn't just take like a few hundred bucks, you sign a paper, then you have a child. It's so expensive and it's such a lengthy process for, for adoption, um, for artificial insemination. You, it, it's not cheap either, not cheap at all. Um, for any of that, for getting sperm from a sperm bank, I don't know how all that stuff works out. I didn't, didn't I could have Googled some of that stuff before I made this video. But the thing that does upset me is that all of these options generally are going to cost the couple a significant amount of money. And, and that's sad because just having a, a heterosexual couple just getting pregnant, there's already so many, so much cost when you first have the child. You, like, it's already crazy expensive to have a kid. And now as a, as a, um, a lesbian couple, it's, it's all these added uh, costs on top of that. So that's definitely something that I, um, I'm worried about is actually having the means to have a child or have, have more than one children. I would def I would like to have at least two kids, uh, two boys, because girls are crazy. I don't want to raise girls. I want to raise boys. Those are my thoughts on the matter. It's Friday. I hope you guys are having a good day. It's really kind of, I'm looking out the window right now in my dining room. It's really gloomy and rainy and gross here in the Burlington area. Um, I hope you guys are having some better weather. That would be nice on a Friday, and then you can go out and have your uh, gay old time tonight. And I will see you guys uh, sometime soon, and have a good weekend. Okay, bye.